Hey kids, Inverticow here. Welcome back to Wolf Hunt. Oh, sorry. Uh, the Long Dark. Uh, we've been around now just over, or just under 24 days. Um, and we have to deal with an average of two and a half wolves a day. Um, yeah, I'm starting to get really irritated by the ridiculousness of the wolves. Um, we're now hit our all-time records on most things here. Uh, this game, I think, is running one of the ones the longest so far. Um, I've killed 10 wolves, so obviously I've killed more than I've been able to find the pelts for. Uh, and Fluffy despawned. Figure that one. All right, back to game. All right, so here's the problem we have. I have some equipment that I need at the cabin. I have nothing for food. I'm hungry and I'm thirsty. I have one can of dog food and no water, so I have to make a fire to make water. Um, I'm really, really irritated by the two wolf minimum to hike, hunt, hike back and forth to the cabin. Uh, and I'd rather not continue doing that. So I'm going to take the second storm lantern and the third storm lantern. Uh, I'm going to leave all of this gear here for now and all that gear there. What I had wanted to do was move the last of my gear from the cabin over to um, the dam here so that I could transfer uh, what I needed, craft what I needed, and move onward. The lack of food and... Um, did I remember fire starter stuff? I bet I didn't. No, I didn't. Mm. The lack of food and uh, the lack of supplies is starting to uh, become very concerning for me. Uh, so I'm just going to grab some fire wood uh, material and I'm going to go make some water. I'm still going to make the effort to get to the coastal highway, but uh, I really do need to make one trip, at least one more trip back to the cabin and get um, one more load of uh, equipment out of there. There is some stuff that I would particularly like to have with me. Um, not sure if I'm going to do it or not, simply because I have no choice but to go and forage for food. And this is the safest location to forage food in uh, right now. What? How do I not have matches? Okay. <clears throat> Drop that one. 
equip this one and light it. Yeah, it's in the middle of the floor. It's out of fuel. I know I have fuel on me. Uh, this place is wretched because there is no light whatsoever. This doorway is the first of the transition areas to uh, the area called Pleasant Valley. I'll take that. And for some reason it doesn't want to let you pick up the scarf that is on the ground in front of this corpse. So. Uh, because I'm in dire need for food, I'm going to just keep searching. Okay, that door does head out to uh, another exit outside. Um, I'm not too keen on going out there. Uh, this is a location you can come back to and harvest tons of scrap metal as well. Um, but the thing is, is I really need to find some basic supplies right now, so I'm going to keep searching and see what I can find. Sometimes you can open those. Is that a newspaper? Take it just to be... I believe there's another workbench down here somewhere as well. Over here somewhere, I think. Yes. <clears throat> Hope nobody needs this anymore. Mm. And you hope you're not the only one. Over there, no. Okay, container. Okay. Um, I'm not going to Pleasant Valley, so I'm not going to go through all of the transition areas. I am just going to rummage through here till I get to the and um, there is a deer carcass outside uh, the exit here as well that I might just go and harvest. I go. Mm. But usually you can forage quite a good deal of food uh, or material on this, each walkthrough on this thing. And I keep taking a lot of this stuff and I never use it. Um, haven't figured out a use for the tools yet. A lot of noise. 
for a very little payout. How long do you figure it would take to search an empty drawer or an empty locker? I mean, seriously, how much junk is actually in those in those lockers? Okay, that's not usual. That's no good. Um, yeah, those broken metal control boxes. You break them down for scrap metal when you get the. Uh, uh, hacksaw. That's what I'm thinking of. Oddly enough, you don't seem to find a hacksaw in, um, uh, the Mystery Lake region. <clears throat> Now, this door is jammed. You can't go out it. But I believe this is your return entrance. Okay. Nothing in the refrigerator. Nothing in the microwave. Nothing under the shelves. Why this is being incredibly stingy today. More so than normal, let's just say that. It's being more stingy than it normally is. Let's see, when we watch the news. Yeah. is not part of metal shelf. Yeah. Okay. So that's your return. I believe that's your return. You can't go out from this location. And you can't go past it. It basically this is a dead end from this point forward. So like that door's closed. There's no other exits. You crawl in through a window up here. One of these windows is broken. There it is, the one with all the frost. <clears throat> Search those. Okay, so the payout wasn't all that great so far. That's okay. Yeah, I searched under the stairs. Still having a, a like dislike with the controller. Uh, the thing I don't like is you can't configure the controls, so I can't use the controller for moving one-handed and the mouse for looking. I find the mouse works better for inventory control and it's smoother for looking. Um, 
Okay. This is the second area of the three to heading towards Pleasant Valley. Um, I could use this. You hear a wolf, but as far as the map says, there are no wolves in this area. Uh, but they are really tricky because there's a little box in behind there, and if you want it, you gotta break all these pallets. Which is two hours of your time. And I got 200 calories. I don't even have enough time to, or enough calories to even think about it. And I'm gonna do though, real quick here. Alter that calorie count a little bit. Yep, yeah, nom that back. You bet. Can of pop and a can of dog food. Mmm. That's the healthiest meal you've eaten all day. Okay. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go to tools. I have another storm lantern. There's one that's equipped. We're going to refuel this one. And we're going to relight this one. It is nighttime. I could probably um, could probably have made the trick to the um, to the cabin now. Oh, not being able to jump. Hearing rabbits squeal. See, so you can't go back in. So you're kind of stuck. Once you come out here, you're stuck. The way back in is a bit perilous to get to. Sorry if I'm quiet, it's because I'm focused. <laughs> you don't want to do this uh, and misstep, and I'm still getting used to the controller over the keyboard. Of course, I probably could have just used the keyboard and had just a straight walk. But. Again, there is no place to cook here. You can make fires outdoors, but that's about it. Um, again, they love to stack these pallets in front of these pipes so that the uh, items that are hidden in them can't be found. Now that's a tree. Here's our ravaged deer carcass. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, that's right. And I didn't even find matches. That's a lot of meat. Mm, not really, because I used the wrong tool for harvesting that meat. It took me twice as long as it should have, because 
reasons. Uh, all right. Let's see what that is. That. We'll pick this stuff up. there's anything else over here of real interest. I think it's just scrap metal and stuff is about the only thing over here. Okay, now there's, there we go. Back to the lower dam. <clears throat> Should recognize where we are. Yeah, it's back in that room. So I'm going to trek back to the top of the dam here and see if I can save my guy's life. Kind of tricky with that. It's just kind of a one-way thing. <clears throat> but we're gonna run through the dam, um, and then I'm going to end this mission or end this uh, episode. It's according to my thing again, I'm already 25 minutes long. Kind of irritated that uh, Fluffy disappeared. Alright, we're back at the entrance to the dam. Um, we're just going to drop some inventory. to die but more than likely going to happen here I have a little bit of raw venison that has to be cooked and a granola bar with a little bit of water um, somewhere in this mess I dropped all of my matches Okay. Uh, 
uh, not going to sleep for now. Um, I'm going to end it here. I'm going to see if I can find some matches, see if I can get my guy fed with what's left of the food we have, and then we'll see what we can do. Thanks for watching, kids. And I'll see you next episode. Good night for now.